In today's video, we have a 10-foot matchup. Two teams, 10-foot point guards, is gonna be a crazy one. Now, in this video, I did make sure that the opponents were pretty good because I wanted to make sure on the black talk we had some type of some type of good matchup. You feel me? But that's it for me. If you're not subscribed, be sure to hit that sub button because this is the only place you can get content like this. I also want to say that I do have a giveaway going on right now. I'm giving away an Xbox One with NBA 2K20, and I'm actually about to go out and buy the Xbox today. So go ahead and hit the link in the description to sign up. But that's it for me. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. You guys get it popping. We are up against a 10 foot James Harden and to start off the game, this dude puts it between my legs. Hey, nah, nah, we gotta get him right back. We gotta get him right back. We're gonna hit him with a double behind the back and we're gonna take it to the rack. Chris Paul as a 10 footer is dangerous, but so is James Harden if I give him easy lanes to the basket. And now we're turning the ball over. We cannot keep doing this because Harden is getting an easy slam in transition. We're going to get the easy bucket right here. Double behind the back move because it's just too deadly. There we go. We get a little steal right there. And now we get the slam in transition. The score is now 5-5, five to five, and it's 1st to 50, so we got a little ways away. And guarding James Harden is going to be trouble because this dude is just going to travel the whole time. I mean, did you just see that? But what I'm going to try to do right here, hold on, hold on. I want to fade away. I want to back him down. I want to hit him with a spin fade away over his face. Give me that ball. Let's go. Another easy steal right there. Another. Ah. I was about to say another little layup. But let's try to get the ball by. And we're going to take off from outside the key. But if I don't stay in the key to guard Harden, I'm going to lose this game. Like, we cannot keep doing this. So let's go. A little crossover move. A little crossover move on James Harden. Little step back move, another step back, and we're gonna drop the dime to Tracy McGrady, the green release layer. You see, this game, it's a lot faster paced than your normal game, especially because we're guarding James Harding, and this dude, this dude is just ridiculous. But I'm not worried, I'm gonna get him right back. Little size up, step back, ooh. Wow, we're stepping out of bounds. I can't do anything about that. I wasn't guarding him, but next time I got him. As of right now, we can go ISO with James Harden once again, pulling up in his face, but now we're missing. That was a bad jumper. And we get the steal. Let's go. Let me redeem myself.
Wow, I could have gone right up with that. But instead, I passed it out for the terrible jumper. And now we're letting Chris Paul go for some layups. Because everybody's so tall, the floaters go up 20 feet. But look, look, no one's in front of me. I got this. Hold on now. Give it back to me. Give it back to Jaeger. Let me beat Harden off the dribble. Let me show you what I can do. Split the double team for the easy little layup. I know they just want to go ISO with James Harden. I know. Oh, look at this. Look at this. We get the steal and we get the slam. 17 to 15. And we get another steal. Another slam. What terrible offense. That was a terrible pass. And they're turning it over one more time. Now we're going for the lob. Ooh. And now he's hitting threes. Okay, I see you. Ooh, what a move. That was disgusting. He beat me with that crossover, but I beat them with the slam. Wow, what a move. Nice and simple. The little spin move off the inbounds. I mean, there's nothing he could do about that. He's just not quick enough. But he's going to put me back in the ISO. Oh, that was disgusting. Oh, come on, 2K. Don't, don't make me jump from them park little dribble moves. Like, come on now. Let me try to beat him off the dribble. Let me try to get him right back because that was nasty. There we go. That's a green release. He misses the dunk after the terrible defense. And now we've got the open lane in transition. We hit the same dunk he just tried to do 10 seconds ago. But I got to get in front of him. No easy blow bys, no easy layups. I'd rather foul you than give you them two points. No, you don't get that out of here. We're picking it up on defense. And now we get the lane. Now we got the slam. I'd rather put that double team on him than leave Harden. Ah, I thought I got that still. 2K, don't, don't do me like that. Now we're missing easy little layups. I don't know what to say anymore. Oh, but we get the steal. Let me redeem myself. Give me them. Oh, no. Now we're really missing. Like, this ain't good. Oh, but we get the block right there. More than halfway through the game. And Harden is picking up his defense. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because I can shoot right over him. He can't put his hands up high enough to stop me. But my bad defense gives him an easy two. Okay, give it to me. We're going to try to take it right to him. We're going to hit him with the dribble move. We're going to hit him with the ankle breaker. Look at that slam right there. Sham God behind the back. Oh, there's the dime right there. Great cut by McGrady. I'm normally not passing it, but if I see a cut like that, I'm going to drop them dimes. But I really got to try here on defense. I can't give Harden any easy twos. I really have to try my best. But 2K forces me out of the way after I jumped. Ah, uh, this is, dude, this is not easy. Like, James Harden as a six-footer is a problem. But James Harden as a ten-footer is a major problem. Ah, 
All right, we're back in front of Harden, but it doesn't matter. He gets the blow by animation. But let me try to get him right back. Let me try to hit him with an ISO back because I can't guard him, but he can't guard me either. Pulling up for the three. 35 to 31. The game is coming to an end. It's coming to an end. So we got to do something here. Ah, come on, guys. Come on, guys. We got to do something to, to put them in their place, to show them what's up. We got to destroy them off the dribble once again. The game's almost over, so we really have to leave our mark. Pulling up for a three. What you doing? Where's the defense? I know that's my first three of the game. But we all know I can hit those. Hey, there we go. There's that good defense. But Chris Paul is pulling up. Ah, okay. It's all good, though. Watch what I do. Watch what I do. Hop step. Ah, okay, that's not working. Ooh, almost turned it over. But we have position and we have a lane. Wow, where's the defense? That's money. They're sagging on defense. They're going to have to pay for that one. But now Harden is shooting and Harden is missing. And we're going back in transition. A little hop step. Oh, that's a bad layup. That's a terrible layup. And now they get the slam in transition. 43 to 37. Harden's guarding me at the half court. But it's okay because I can beat him off the dribble for the step back jumper. Yo, like there's nothing you can do about that. We're both going crazy in the ISO. But I'm on something different. There we go. Look at that turnover. And now we've got the lane for the 360 slam. I do want to end off the game on something crazy. Wow, he's really going for that mid-range game. It's not going to work. They're still going to miss it. And we're still going to slam it. Final possession of the game, and I want to destroy James Harden, but I'm just going to try my best to get a three right here. Okay, no, no, this ain't working. Give it to me. Give it to me. Let's go for the easy way out. The step back to pull up the game winner. All right, you guys, that is the end of the game. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to hit that sub button. I wanted to make sure that James Harden was also going crazy, so I made sure he was a 99. But that's it. I'll see you guys in my next one. Oh, be sure to hit that sub button. Peace.